Wh what is this place? Hey, help! <coughs> Hello? Let me in! Get down! Who are you? What's going on? What happened? Shh! You need to stay calm. How can I stay calm? Look around! Everyone's d d dead I've seen worse. I'm guessing you're not from around here then? No, I just work up in a lab place. I need to get back home. Sorry to ruin your plans, but all cities are long gone. What do you mean long gone? I need to get home. To to whoever my family is I told you it's long gone just point me in the right direction and I'll be on my way how long were you asleep for um I don't know you weren't supposed to answer that but okay are you going to explain what's going on, or...? I will, but not here. It's not safe. Not... safe. I suggest not yelling and walking around in plain sight, and I also suggest sticking with me if you want to survive. <laughs> How can I trust you? I don't even know your name. It's Amari. What an odd name. Okay, I'm Ellie. Huh, what an odd name. <laughs> what? It's not odd. My name is not either. Wait, we're not going down there, are we? Where else are we gonna go? Group A will be coming soon. 
You don't want to be around when they're here. Trust me. What do you mean by Group A? First of all, you must be starving. Here, have some canned peaches. Uh, thanks. Be grateful. That was hard to get. And secondly, sit down and be prepared for a long story. Oh, great. <sighs> and thirdly, shut up, stop asking questions, and eat your peaches while I talk. But... Ah, I said no talking. Now I shall start from the beginning. In 2030, a dangerous virus broke out. We call it the Death Wave. This virus wiped out most of humanity. Some humans managed to survive in underground bunkers or cities that were closed off from the outside world. That's Group A. Some others had rare blood types and were automatically immune to the virus. Those people are in Group B. And then there's some others who had adapted to the virus instead of dying or being immune. They mutated. Everyone else calls them freaks. That's Group C. So, is 2030 right now? Shut up! I'm not done! And to answer your question, no, it's not. It's 2055. <coughs> what?! Shh! Don't be so loud! What was that? Let me in! The rain? We have to let them in. Don't. It's too late for them. We can't leave her out there. I told you, it's too late. Open the door! We have to let her inside, Amari. She should be dead by now. I'm opening the door. No! Why not? We need to leave. Why? She's trying to trick us. She's a part of Group A. How do you know, though? You stupid immune freaks! <laughs> Ellie! Why did she do that? Why did you kill her? Welcome to my world. Amari, I found it. Good. Get the hammer and destroy it. Will do. Uh, there's a radiation storm heading our way. Make sure you have destroyed the radio completely, then get on your vehicle and get the hell out of there! Alright, meet you back at the base.
Finally, I can play some music. <laughs> Didn't you listen to music in the rover? The stereo is dead, but the stereo still works here. Warning, oxygen levels, critical. Warning, oxygen levels, critical. Warning, oxygen levels, critical. What's going on? The storm. The oxygen levels are going down. We have to go outside or we'll suffocate. In the storm? Yes, come on! No, uh, that's dangerous. We should find another way. We're both immune to the virus, acid rain, and storms. It won't hurt us. Oxygen levels, 40%. We'll suffocate if we stay here. Ah! What's wrong? Did the rain hurt you? We need to find another way. Let me see your ears. Huh? You're... You're not immune, are you? You're a freak. I... Why didn't you tell me? Because you can't trust many people anymore. Everyone hates freaks and will do anything to kill us. I'm not going to hurt you, Amari. You sure about that? I'm sure. Now, I guess as long as we keep the door open, we'll have oxygen. <sighs> okay. And... Sorry about your hands. <laughs> it's alright. Everything you told me about how you've survived, and that you've been alone most of your life, was that a lie too? Y yeah. What really happened to you? There's a place on Earth. Not too far away from here, actually. Called Tazara. And it's the only place that has vegetation left. That's where all the freaks live. One of the reasons why everyone hates us freaks is because we have the one place on Earth left that has a safe haven. Why didn't you tell me this before? Why aren't we going there? The freaks have it all locked down. A massive wall surrounding it. Guards on watch 24-7. But you can get inside. I... I can't. What? But you're a freak! I was... banished from there years ago. If I go back, they'll kill me. That's why I've been surviving alone ever since. Everyone. And I mean, everyone wants me dead. Even my own people. I don't want you dead. You and I, were going to survive. And along with surviving, we're going to get our revenge. We'll take over Nexus, save all the freaks and all the immune, and we'll make everything right. All by ourselves? Yes, all by ourselves. Hey, the storm has stopped. That was quick. Let's head over to that base, while their radios are still out signal. Good idea.
Okay, here's the plan. You find some way to distract them, and I'll go and save all the prisoners. My brother is in there. What? They have him in there. Is that why you wanted to go to this base? Because your brother is here? Yeah. He doesn't deserve this. He's so young. What's his name? Leo. Dark brown hair, blue eyes just like mine. But of course he's shorter. <laughs> I'll make sure he gets out. You just worry about distracting. <laughs> Don't worry. I got smoke grenades and matches. Perfect. Good luck. And please, make sure my brother gets out of here alive. I will. Come on, everyone! We need to go! Hey, is your name Leo? He, yes. Why? You have to come with me. L why? One word. Amari. You know my sister? No time to explain, just come. Hello? Can anyone hear me? We need help. Somebody set our camp on fire. Is anyone picking up? No. The signal's cut off. Must be something wrong with the radio antennas. Maybe the storm destroyed them. Or maybe someone destroyed them. We have to... <coughs> this is what you all deserve. <coughs> Next time on Into the Unknown. Who are you? Oh, okay, just put the gun down. Amari! Amari! Where is my sister? I... I don't know. Let me go! J j just stay awake!
Who are you? Just put the gun down. Answer me. I, I, I'm a part of Group A. I'm human. What happened here? The camp was attacked. I don't know who by. All I remember is smoke, then blacking out. Uh, I'm sorry for pointing my gun at you. Here, you need a gas mask or something. You don't want to catch the virus. Thank you. Hello, oh, and I'm Jackson. I'm a part of Group A as well. I'm Amari. Huh, sounds like a name for a freak. Well, it was only a name my parents gave me. Right, sorry, that was rude of me. I've been alone for over a year now. Sort of lost my communication with Rose a little bit. Out of my manners. <laughs> Don't worry, I understand. I've been alone for a while too. But, don't you live here? Oh! I do! But I mean, nobody here really talks to me, so it feels like I'm alone. Alright, well, you can't exactly stay here. I know. I actually should get going. I need to go and look for my friend. Okay, stay safe, I guess. I... Hey, there's a rip in your suit. Ah, oh, I'll be alright. Here, let me fix it. I won't be long. Hmm, fine. Don't be... Long. What's... wrong? We need to go. Wait, why? Aren't they your people? No, yes, just... just come. Why are they shooting at us? Shut up and run! What was that? Gunshots. It's coming from that camp. Is Amari there? Let's hope not. It's those bad people. They want to hurt us. I know, but your sister and I will make sure nothing happens to you. They injected us with pointy needles. It hurt. Do you know why they injected you? They said it was to save us. When did this happen? I don't know. Here, we'll worry about that later. But at the moment, we need to find Amari. Is she dead? No, no. Knowing Amari, she would have left already. But she also wasn't at the base. The only other place would be... the city. Bad place. I know you don't want to go there, but if we're going to find your sister, she'll be in the city. Let's get moving. It'll be night soon. Care to explain who they were? Nexus. But they were shooting at us. They only kill people who are immune or freaks. Not anymore. They kill anyone in sight. Since when? Since now. Why? Wish I knew the answer to that, but I have no idea. Here, I, I think we're far enough. Let me stitch up the hole in your suit. We have to keep moving. Not until I fix it. Fine. And there. Good as new. Thanks. No problem. Now, I should really go and look for my friend. <sighs> Stay safe, Jackson. Wait, maybe I should go with you. Help you look for your friend? Oh, no. It's fine. Really. I can manage myself. No, I insist. 
<sighs> Guess I can't persuade you otherwise. Let's go then. We should wait till morning though. It'll be nice, surely. Good point. We can stay here for the night. Are you sure it's safe to stay here? It's safe. Don't worry about that. I have a question. Yeah? How did you and my sister meet? Well, I woke up from a long, deep sleep. And I was lost. Confused, even. Your sister came and helped me. We've stuck by each other's side ever since. Where were you before you met Amari? I was in a whole different world, but it's long gone now. Before the death wave? Yeah, before the death wave. Let me go! What was that? Just wait here, Leo, okay? Uh, okay. You're coming with us. Let me go! Stupid of you and I think you raiders are the stupid ones here. J just stay awake. You'll be okay. Uh, uh. Stay still. I'm not the best with this sort of thing. You don't have morphine or something? No, I'm nearly done anyway. Just please stay quiet. We can't draw too much attention. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Thank you. You're really not good at dealing with pain, are you? <laughs> it's not every day I get shot. And we are done. Oh, it's over. Just rest for a bit. Wait, I didn't catch your names. I'm Ellie, and this is Leo. Wait, he's... A freak? You got a problem with that? No, no, not at all. Good. Well, I'm Samuel. Nice to meet you. Now, as I said earlier, get some rest. See you in the morning. Mr. Carter, what are you and Nexus doing with the immune? The immune are our last hope. Their blood can save us all. We have given the immune consent forms, and if they sign, then we have permission to do tests on them. If you don't give us consent, then we leave them alone. We only take immunes into our labs if we have their permission. They sacrifice themselves for us. Now, any other questions? And what do you do with the freaks? Ma'am, we don't have anything to do with the freaks. We don't touch them. You liar! I've seen you take freaks into your labs. I've seen you drag them inside. No! He's lying! Nexus is lying! You have to listen to me. We can't trust Nexus. They're torturing the immune till death, whether they have permission or not. They're killing the freaks, gassing them. Please, someone listen to me. How did you find out that information? Who sent you here? No one did. Unlike you, I work alone. 
I don't have dogs helping me every step of the way. Miss... Coleman. Miss Coleman, I don't think you understand, but what we're doing here at Nexus is what's right for humanity. <laughs> you think killing people is what's right for humanity? You're in a bad position, Miss Coleman. I'd be careful with your words. Listen, you don't want me to tell anyone. Fine, I won't. But just know that one day someone else will find out the truth. Just let me go and I won't bother you again. Now, now, Miss Coleman. We can't exactly let you go just like that. You could easily go and spread the word. This is stupid. I'm just doing my job. And that's making sure everything goes to plan. We can't have any rats in the way, now can we? Wait, what are you? Burn the body. Get rid of the evidence. This never happened. You two heard him. Clean up this mess. Where are we off to exactly? I'm trying to find my friend. Sure he's not dead already? It's a she. Sorry, I mean, are you sure she's not dead? You don't know Amari like I do. She'll be alive. You two are close then. We're like sisters. And who's Leo supposed to be? Amari's little... friend. Little? Yeah, well, he's short. But I'm her... Best friend! <laughs> right, sorry, I forgot. <laughs> and how old is Amari? She's 17, like me. And she's friends with a little kid? I'm not little. These days, you can become friends with anyone, no matter who or how old you are. Not really, but alright. You know, you don't have to come with us. I might as well. It gets pretty lonely when you're by yourself all the time. It would be. What's a m my fed? It's a minefield. What's a my fed? We need to find another way around. Let me just test something. Wait, what are you? Yeah, we should find another way. You think? You didn't uh, want to go this way, did you? What's wrong? Looks like a minefield to me. This never used to be here. Maybe we just took a wrong turn? No. A week ago, this wasn't here. Either way, we can't get through this. I've come across a few minefields in the past, and I'm telling you, we can't get through that. Then... We'll go this way. That's towards... To Sarah. We can't go that way. Why not? That's where the freaks are. We don't have a choice. Could go that way. Jackson, you know there's high chances of storms that way? We can't risk getting caught in a radiation storm. Why do we even need to go this way? Because, that's the direction of Nexus. I think they may have my friend. Why do you think that? She's immune. Okay, we'll go to Tessara then. You any good at flying by any chance? No, why? Because... 
I know a way to get through this minefield. You're not serious, are you? Oh, I'm serious as I'll ever be. Oh no, okay. You are actually insane. I know, but we need to find Amari. I know for a fact that she'll be heading that way too. She probably hasn't found a way across the minefield either. She's quite smart. She'll find a way. Can't we just go around? It'll take too long. We could simply go through Tessera, or even through- No, too many freaks in Tessera. And the other way around has radiation storms. You should know this! But there's loads of underground tunnels that way. No, we're- Leo, what happened? There was something that looked like that. It was above the mice head, and then a shooting star came and hit it. Big explosion. Then it fell. Nexus! N Nexus did this? They do anything to get what they want, Ellie. Sounds like flying isn't as safe as you thought. I suppose it's your way then. Don't worry, the tunnels are safe. Worst thing that can happen is a werewolf attacks us. Other than that, we're pretty safe. W werewolf Yeah, but they can be friendly. When they want to. What's wrong? You seem... very distracted? Jackson! Huh? You okay? Yeah, it's just... I've never seen a tree before. They're beautiful, aren't they? You've been here before? Uh... once. How? Didn't the freaks catch you? I'm pretty good at sneaking around. We should start moving faster. We don't want to run into any freaks now, do we? Good idea. I don't want to run into any today. But you're right. Sasara is... amazing. Hey, have you ever tried one of these before? What? What is it? It's fruit. It's called an apple. There used to be hundreds of these, before the death wave. Here, try it. I, I can't, I can't take off this suit. Why? I mean, most people in group A only have to wear a gas mask, not a whole suit. It, it's just better if I keep it on. Okay, but how do you eat? Liquid food. This suit is built with a tube and a whole system. Hard to explain, but it works. My father made it. And how long have you worn it without taking it off? About two months, I think. Two months? Yeah. I wish there was a way that you humans wouldn't have to go for all that. What? Uh, I mean, us humans! Horrible what we have to deal with! Hey, look out! <laughs> you alright? Yep, I, uh, sort of forgot about all the dried up rivers. <laughs> <laughs> Here. Thanks. No pro- Hey, you're- You're here. Let's get out of here. Wait, I'm alright. Hmm? Yeah? Are you- Am I what? You know what? Don't worry about it. Okay, well, we should keep moving. Tazara isn't exactly the safest place. You're right. The other side should be uh, this way.
you think it's odd? What's odd? First, the princess goes missing. Then the prince. And then the king and queen are both killed. Don't you find that a bit weird? I suppose. The poor princess. Commander. What is it? Amari's alive. Next time on Into the Unknown. Leo, what's wrong? Uh, I thought it was a mouse. Oh, come on. They aren't that scary. They won't hurt you. Samuel? Sounds like we have company. We can go this way! We can't. It's not on my map. We could get lost. Screw the map! This is about surviving! Fine. We'll go your way then. Hey! Let me go! Did you hear that? Yeah, I did. You alright? Yeah. Now I am. Thank you both so much for helping me. It's no problem. What group are you from? Oh, Group A. You need a gas mask. Here, I have a spare one. How many gas masks do you have? Enough for emergencies. Thank you. So, what happened here? I was just minding my own business, then they came along and tried to steal all my stuff. That's right, it's for you. You're by yourself? Yep, I'm a lone wolf, as they say. How about you come with us? That way, this is never gonna happen again. Seriously? Yeah, we don't mind. Th thank you. There aren't many kind people in the Badlands these days. You're both the first I've come across that don't try to kill me. Is that so? Yep. So which groups are you from? We're both Group A. Should have guessed since you're both wearing gas masks. Jackson, can I, uh, talk to you for a sec? Yeah, sure. We'll be right back. We shouldn't trust him. He was just attacked by raiders. He needs help. There's someone about him that just isn't right. I can't put my finger on it. Amari, there's nothing to worry about. I, I know, but doesn't this feel like a setup or something to you? Let's just get going. This is stupid. What did you say? Oh, nothing. What is that? It is that? We should run.
Where, where are we supposed to go? If we followed the map, then maybe we wouldn't have this problem. Just, what can we do? Wait, there's stairs here. Well, hurry up and open it. it it's coming closer. Let's get out of here. That was close. At least we made it to the other side of the minefield. Oh, you're right. There's people over there. What do you mean, people? We should get down. There could be raiders. Amari! Ellie, wait! Amari! Ellie? Y you're alive! How did you get out of that camp? I got help from... Jackson. When did you meet these two? Bit of a long story. Sis? Leo? Amari, I saw a big helicopter and it, it went kaboom. <laughs> you did? Yes. Oh, and Elon has been looking for you everywhere. He sent out search parties. He says that the one... Okay, well, uh, who's this? Right, this is Samuel. I'm assuming you're from Group A? Y yeah I'm your average human. Is that little boy a... a freak? Yes, he's a freak. He's my... a friend! Yeah, we met a long time ago in the wasteland. But he called you sis? We're like brother and sister. We're very close, but we're not related. Sorry to ruin the reunions, but we gotta find shelter there should be a city nearby. You can find shelter there. You know the area? A little bit. I've been here and there. You lead the way then. Jackson, is it? Yeah. Jackson Carter. Samuel Ridge. What is this place? Del Toro. One of the very last cities that still has civilians. We can blend in. Only issue is Leo. We can just cover his ears with his hair. Make sure no one sees that he's a freak. Alright. I have a friend here named Reuben. He'll let us stay with him till we figure out what we're doing. Are you sure no one will realize we're outsiders? As long as you wear the gas masks and keep your head down, you'll be fine. Get away! Stay back! Dude, it's me! Jackson! Oh. Right. Sorry. Gotta be cautious these days. <laughs> Please. Come in. And who are these lovely people you've brought with you? Samuel and Ellie. They're both immune. Why would you bring them here? To Del Toro? We won't be here long. Then we have Connor and Amari, they're from Group A. And this little guy, named Leo, he's a freak. Have you gone insane? Why the hell would you bring a freak here? Shh! Keep your voice down, will you? I'm sorry, but you're putting them all in danger. We just need somewhere to stay. Please, Reuben, we'll leave tomorrow. Fine. There's some spare rooms upstairs.
Thank you for helping us. It's no problem. But if you get caught, don't come running to me for help. Mr. Carter, has there been any progress? Not as of yet. We still haven't found a cure. I guess we'll have to go to plan B. Are the nukes ready? We're making progress, but we need more time. Time is precious, Mr. Shen. I am aware of that, but what do you plan to do with the nukes anyway? Destroy everything. Amari! Huh? What is it? Alien Samuel are missing. What? Connor said he saw them being knocked out and taken by... Taken by who? Nexus. Why didn't Connor stop them? One of the Nexus guys saw him and knocked him out before he could do anything. How did anyone know that they were immune? Don't ask me. Was it Reuben? I've known Reuben for a long time, and I know we can trust him. Then, who told Nexus they were here? I don't know. But what we need to worry about is getting them out of there. H how It's close to impossible. I have a plan. I send Reuben to go get one of his friends. Connor, Reuben, and his friend, along with Leo, will start getting some weapons together and vehicles. And what about us? We're both going to the bunker I grew up in. There's loads of maps there of the inside of Nexus. We can use them to make a plan to get inside. How did you get those? That's a story for another time. Okay, and where's the bunker? That's, uh, that's the thing. We'll need to go back through to Sarah. You mean it's on the other side of the minefield? Yes, sadly. You have to be kidding me. If we hurry, we'll make it back unnoticed. Alright, but is there another way other than going through to Sarah? Not that I know of. But why would you want to go another way? You were fine going through there before. I, I know. It's fine. We can go that way again. Good. I've already packed everything. Let's go then. Uh, uh Mari? Uh, uh, where are you going? I'm just going on a little trip, okay? I'll be back soon. Connor will take care of you. Yep, I'm the best with kids. Is that so? Okay, well, keep a close eye on him. Will do. Sage, you home? It's Reuben. Yes, come in. Sage, I need some help. Okay, what do you need help with? Do you still happen to make guns at all? What do you need guns for? One word. Nexus. I'll start making some right away. Any specific kind you'd like? Machine guns. And how many? Four. I'll make that five. Why five? Did you really think I'd let you go and take over Nexus without me? No. We're not taking over Nexus. We're just trying to save some people. It's still a fight, and still involves killing. I'm down for a fight, and fresh blood. You freaks. I swear. What? There's nothing wrong with us werewolves. You crave human blood. So, I only kill bad guys. Fine. Meet me back at my place once you've got the guns ready. Of course. I have to say, freaks are lucky. Not really. Everyone is always after them. Plus, it's not that great in Tazara. How would you know? Uh, uh, I don't. Okay... 
So, which direction is this bunker? Uh, this way. It's not too far away. Alright, great. When do you think Amari will be back? She shouldn't be too long. I hope she'll be okay. So, what's the relationship between you two? Just really close friends? Oh no, she's my older sister. She always looks after me. Older sister? She's a freak too? Mm-hmm. We're both royalty. Mama and Papa are the leaders of Tessera. Royalty? Yep. Amari is getting married to Nilon. He's the strongest and bravest out of all freaks. Are you supposed to be out here in the Badlands? No, but Amari ran away. Then I followed, but got caught by bad people. Bad people? What did they do to you? They got a sharp needle and stuck it in my arm. It hurt, but I'm okay. Well, that's odd. <coughs> you okay? Mm-hmm. I'm all good. Ellie. Ellie, are you okay? S Samuel? <sighs> I thought you'd never wake up. Where are we? Nexus. W what? How did we get here? It was Connor. You're saying he'd taken us here? You think he betrayed us? I don't think he did. I know he did. I saw him before he knocked me out cold. Ellie, we can't trust Connor. I had a feeling something was off. But how are we supposed to get out of here? That's what I've been trying to figure out. The guards change shift every four hours, but in between the shifts, it's not enough time to escape. Can't we try to knock him out? There's too many of them. It's impossible. Please, I beg you. Please don't! Get him ready for harvest. No, 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 please! What are they doing? They're harvesting him. What's that supposed to mean? You really don't want to know. They're going to kill him, aren't they? We'll be next. We need one more. I've been trying to find a way out, and there's only one way to do it. And that is... You wait here. Don't copy what I'm doing. I'll come back and get you. Wait, what are you... Hey! Over here! Take this one. Samuel! It'll be okay. Don't worry, it will only take 20 minutes until you lose all of your blood. Don't! Shh, it's okay, Samuel. You won't feel a thing. Your blood is special. You can save humanity. Do you realize that? Well, enjoy dying! I wish we didn't have to do this. How's it going? We're keeping up a schedule. Everything is going well. Any success? We have a cure ready to test. Let's get a test subject in right away. I think we shouldn't test it on people though. Why not? We're killing innocent people. Don't you think there's something wrong with that? Alicia, 
We're just doing what's right for humanity. Now, just get back to work. This isn't helping everyone, only Group A. Hmm, maybe. Hey, stay awake. Why are you helping m me? I'm just doing what I think is right. Now we don't have much time. I have to get you out of here. I... I can't feel... Oh, great. And here we are. You remember the pass card? Yeah, it's easy. Let me just... Uh, it's just been a while since I've been here. Um... You don't remember it, do you? Of course I do. M maybe I just used all lowercase and didn't add in the capitals. Type in your birthday. Why would it be that? You never know. Fine. I'll try it. Okay, type in Nexus. Now what? We don't know the passcode and... Get back! Wait, why? You might want to run! Why well, you look at that? We opened it. Where did you get the bomb from? I carry approximately four bombs, along with a packet of matches, a lighter, string, a shotgun of extra ammo, a bow and 30 arrows, a pocket knife, poison, an air horn, a flashlight, glow sticks, a walkie talkie, and a spray can of spray paint. Wow. You're prepared. You gotta be prepared for anything these days. But I question the spray paint. It can help you spot a shapeshifter, or a freak that can camouflage. And the air horn? Scares off werewolves. Glow sticks? Scares off vampires! It's like you're carrying a mini sun. You can blind them. And poison. Okay, it's not poison. It's more something I could put into someone's drink and make them, you know, fall asleep. It works best on elves and fairies. You seem to know a lot about freaks for a human. Huh, I guess I do. We should probably look for the maps. Yeah, good idea. You stayed in here for how long again? Seventeen years. That's an awful long time. I didn't exactly have a choice. Hey, are these the maps? Yeah, these are it. How'd you even get access to all of this? My, uh, parents work for Nexus. What? But I'm not like them, I swear. No, I know you can be trusted, but why didn't you tell us sooner? Couldn't risk you betraying me. That makes sense. We should make it back to Del Toro before nightfall, if we leave now. Yeah, let's hurry back to the others. We gotta go! What's the rush? Long story short, a human group named Diana Gang are coming to the city looking for freaks. Diana? Hmm. 
Never heard of him before. Well, you're obviously not from around here, then. Okay, everyone, follow me and stay close. Where are we heading? The subway under the city. Oh, hold up a second. Why would we do that? Diona gang has explosives. And the fact that we have freaks in our group, it's best we leave without being spotted. Alright, Connor, you can go first. Me? Yes, you. We'll be right behind you. You better be. Now it's you, little guy. Where's Amari? You'll see her soon. Don't worry. Uh, okay. Ladies first. I think I should stay behind. Sage, you can't. They'll kill you. I know that, but maybe I can kill them. I can smell their blood from here. It's too dangerous. Ruben, you know nothing can- I got one! I got a freak! You're going to pay for this! Sage! Ruben, come on. What are you doing? You can't leave her here! She's dead. The bullet went right through her head. We have to go before more come. I'm sorry, Sage. Shh. Did you hear that? We should keep moving. Is is that? Yeah. It's a fairy. It's It's so cool. I guess. I don't know why, but I always found freaks fascinating. You're not scared of them? Why would I be scared of them? They're just human after all. They're just a little different. Well, I know the fairies are really cool, but we need to get going. Hey, Yamari. Hey, what do you think you're doing? I'm just taking back what's mine. I'm not yours. Shut up, Amari. Now tell me, where have you been the past year, huh? That's none of your business. But I think it is. What is going on here? Oh, you must be one of her little human friends. Just shut up, Nylon. And why were you wearing a gas mask? You know it's useless to you. I'm guessing your little friend doesn't know who you really are. How about you tell him, Amari? Oh, you want me to tell him? Why didn't you ask? Amari here is for one, a freak. For two, the princess of Tessara. And three, my fiancé. Yeah. Guards, take this one to the prison at once. There you are. Oh, Nylon, what are you doing here? Just checking up on my beautiful fiance. <laughs> That's very sweet of you, but I'm fine. I know you don't like these ceremonies. I just thought I should make sure you're okay. It happens all the time. I'm getting used to it. You sure you're okay? 
Better than ever. I love you. I love you too. I gotta get back to work. I'll see you tomorrow, okay? Alright, see you then. Ophelia, everything will be fine. But... but you're marrying her. Just because I'm marrying her doesn't mean I love her. You know I'm only doing this for the throne. I... I know. But... but... I love you, and only you. As soon as I marry her, I'll kill her in her sleep. I'll be king, and Tessara will be ours. Amari? Are you okay? That... that was a man. He, he hurt me. Who did this to you? He, he was wearing a mask. It's going to be okay. I'll make sure he's brought to justice. Please, Nylon. Kill him for me. I will. I'll make sure of that. What... what... have... I know what you're doing, Nylon. I can't believe I trusted you. What? what You would never get the throne, Nylon. Never. The marriage has been set already, Amari. There's no way out of it. Oh, there is. You're not seriously gonna run away, are you? My place is not in Tazara. And your place is not as king. Enjoy your life of Ophelia. You won't survive in the Badlands. You'll be running back here within the first day. You'll die out there. I guess we'll wait and see. What the... Oh, you're awake! Why did you help me? I have my reasons, but that's to explain later. Firstly, you must be starving. Here's some water. Would you like some sandwiches at all? Sandwiches? Where'd you get that kind of food from? We have a lot of farms here, so we're able to produce our own fresh food. But how is that possible? You can't farm anymore. The virus. It's all indoor farms. Oh. Let me guess, you've been living off canned food your whole life. Pretty much. I'll get you a sandwich then. Ellie! Where's Ellie? Oh, she's still locked up. Forget the sandwiches. She's my friend. We have to get her. If we are to save your friend, we have to at least wait till she's in the harvest room. Who even are you anyway? Professor Evans, but call me Alicia. Are you some kind of scientist or something? Yes, I am. Obviously, I work for Nexus. But if you work for them, then... Samuel, what they're doing is wrong. I'd rather not work for them, but I don't have a choice. How do you know my name? We know the names of everyone that is immune. How is that possible? We have our ways. I have a meeting I have to attend. I'll be back in a couple hours or so. Don't go around exploring. You can't risk getting caught. She is... extraordinary. She's perfect. What? What? Ellie, hi. How are you feeling? Who, who are you? I'm Joyce. The doctor will be working with you. Just keep taking deep breaths. Okay? N no It's okay. Stay calm. N no Let me go! Guards, hold her down. Let me go! Listen, we need you, Ellie. You're more important than you think. You're special. Joyce! Alicia! What are you doing in here? Why are you torturing her like this? I think she's the one we've been looking for all this time. Her blood is nothing like I've ever seen before. 
I think Ellie needs a break. We should wait a bit. You're right. We shouldn't kill her till we know for sure that she's the one. All right. We need to do more tests. What? That's not what I said. I don't take orders from you. Guards, I need you to prepare one of the helicopters for takeoff. Wait, where are you going? Me? I'm not going anywhere. But I want Ellie taken to Area 46. I think some of the other Nexus scientists will want to have a look at her. But that is in a whole other section, across the- Alicia, could you just shut up for a second? You do your work, and I'll do mine. Hey, uh, Reuben. I'm sorry about Sage. She... she was like my best friend. You know? Even though she was a freak, I... I still... She was a good freak, Reuben. She really was. <coughs> Leo, you good? Y yeah just... <coughs> Here, have some water. It'll help. Thanks. Probably the dust from down here. If it was the dust, we would be coughing too. Maybe he's just got a cold. Freaks don't get sick, Connor. They don't? Whatever. Come on. Let's all get some sleep. You want to sleep? Here? Yes. Here. No one will come down here. Trust me, we're safe for now. In a couple hours, it will be safe to get out of here. But for now, we have to stay low. Yes, boss. <coughs> Maybe it is the dust. Here, Leo, put this over your mouth. Oh. <coughs> I got good news and I got bad news. Okay, bad news first. Ellie was just sent to a different Nexus facility. Excuse me? But I thought there was only this one. Well, you're very wrong about that. There's hundreds of them spread across the globe. Oh, jeez. But the good news is that I can get us a helicopter. So we can get Ellie back? You'll help me? Yes, but it'll be dangerous. I know, I can handle a little danger, but... I have some other friends we need to get first. They could help us. I'll get you a radio. You can contact your friends and negotiate a place where we can all meet up. Then we save Ellie. Amari. Where's my parents? Oh, you don't know? No, what? They're dead. You killed them, didn't you? Well, it was really that obvious. Who else would kill them? You won the throne, and it seems like to me that you're the new leader of Tazara. You're very correct. What do you want with me, Nylon? Where's your brother? I don't know. He disappeared. Don't lie to me, Amari. Even if I did know, why would I tell you? You'll just kill him too, to make sure you'll have the throne, all to your pity little self. Let me remind you that you'll have to kill me as well. Why were you into Sara? Reasons that are none of your business. Why were you traveling around with a human? Because some of them aren't as bad as you think. Why did you leave? Isn't it obvious? You were going to kill me! Plus, why would I want to be the leader of the freaks? I never meant to hurt you. 
Oh, now don't give me that. You were with Ophelia, you little- I never cared about her like I cared about you. I love you, Mari. Really? Of course I do. I... I love you too. Seriously? I can't believe you fell for that. Not to mention, again. I'm not lying, Amari. I don't care whether you were telling the truth or not. I don't love you, and I never will ever again. Why are you, oh, are you betraying us freaks? We're your people. I'm not betraying freaks. I'm protecting them. Then why are you leaving? I've told you. I don't belong here. Amari! Wait! Jackson! Huh? We're getting out of here. Did you really think I'd leave you behind? Did anyone see you come here? No, no one saw me. Ugh. What's wrong? Don't worry. They just stabbed me. It's okay though. Let's just get out of here. When? Like, an hour ago? It's fine. Now come on, we need to get back to Del Toro. No, you're hurt. We're gonna go somewhere else first. I can't leave you like this. I'll be okay. It's just a- It's not just a cut, Jackson. The sword would have been poisonous. What? <laughs> Freaks love poison. Bloody hell. Can you walk? I think I can manage. Good. Now, this way. Why are we stopping here? I told you, I need to fix that cup before we head back. Don't worry about it. If I don't, you'll die. Now, suit off. I can't do that. I won't be able to breathe. I'll get sick. You can breathe into Zara and not catch the virus. That's just a myth. It's true, Jackson. Trust me. Plus, your suit is ruined anyway. It's pointless wearing it if there's a massive rip in it. <sighs> Fine. Good. I'll go get the first aid kit. Alright. I got... Are you just gonna stand there, or are you gonna help? R right, sorry. Okay, stay still. Ah, jeez. Sorry, I forgot to warn you that it'll sting. <laughs> sting? More like, ah! I said stay still! <laughs> <laughs> sorry. Well, you're lucky. Because there isn't too much poison. Meaning you'll live. 
Lovely to know I'll live. Just rest for a bit. Nobody will know we're here. We can leave in an hour or so. Sounds like a plan. So, you're a freak. Um, yeah. Why didn't you tell me? Because it's hard to trust people. Everyone is pretty much against us freaks. They think we're all monsters. Honestly though, it's sorta of true. I don't think you're a monster, Mari. Plus, I knew you were a freak anyway. What? I saw your ears. Oh. My question is you're engaged to Nylon? Yeah, it it was more forced. And your The princess. <laughs> don't act like one though. Why did you leave? I don't belong in Desara. I belong out there in the wasteland. Even if I did stay, I would have been killed. How? Here, can we just not talk about this? Please? Right. Sorry. Just curious. Come on, get some sleep. I'll wake you up in an hour. There you go. Wow, you actually look really good in the uniform. Thanks. I think. Now just pretend you're a guard. Act like a guard, speak like a guard, and yeah, you get the drill. I used to be a guard, so I think I could do this pretty easily. You were a guard? Yeah, until our camp was destroyed. I'm sorry. I'm sorry about Nexus and what they're doing to everyone. They're not killing humans. Only immune and freaks. Humans are lucky. Actually, you're wrong. Nexus has started killing humans, too. What? They don't care about anyone, just themselves. They keep saying that they're finding a cure and they're close, but the truth is, they're nowhere near one. Why do you even work for them? If I don't, I die. Enough chit chat. Let's get to the helicopter while there's not many guards around. Great idea. Evans? Wells? You're going to the top floor. Where are you heading? Mr. Carter wants to meet up with me, so I'm heading there now. Shouldn't you take another guard with you? One isn't enough. I think one is enough. I know how to defend myself. Sure? Because I'm not on duty for a while. I could come and help out. I only need one. You sure? She's made it pretty clear that she only needs me. And who are you to tell me that, huh? Who are you anyway? Briggs. There's no guard with that name on this facility. He's new. And why does his badge on this uniform say Smith? That was close. Sorry to say this, but he'll have to come with us. What? Why would we bring him? If we don't, when he wakes up, he could tell someone. We can't risk getting caught, and you know that. Oh, this is just great. You know how to fly? Me? I thought you knew how to. I may be a scientist, but I don't have experience in flying. I know a little bit. That little bit is going to have to be enough. I'll find you, Ellie. Promise. Uh, Mari? Yeah? I can't leave to Sarah. I'll get sick. No, you won't. Here, you can use the gas mask you gave me. Remember, I don't need it. Thanks. Wait, before you put it on, you need to try an apple. 
I... I don't know. You love it! Trust me. One bite. Wow. This is... amazing. Told you so. Now, let's start making tracks, shall we? Hang on, one more bite! Oh, come on! <laughs> Um, J Jackson? What's up? We have a slight problem. What slight? What do we do? We need to find the others. So you just wanna walk right into the city? Yeah, that's a genius plan. No, but we could go underground instead. Is it quick? Yeah, if we run. There has to be enough way in. The sewers, I'm not sure that's a great idea. Especially now that you don't have your full suit. That's too risky, you could easily catch I wasn't suggesting the sewers. But you said we were going underground. The subway. Oh. That's actually a great idea. Let's be quick. We have to find the others. Alright. Did they just say... We need to get Leo. Now. Are you sure this is a good idea? It's the best idea I have. We should be nearly there. Great to hear. Hey, see those lights up ahead? Yeah, I do. I... I think it's flashlights. Hey, who's that over there? Was that Connor? I think so. Amari? Jackson? Thank god you're all in one piece. Amari! And no hugs for me. Hey, where's Sage? She, uh... She... Didn't make it. I'm sorry to hear that. That's not something we should be thinking about now. We need to leave the city before others start heading down here. But where are we going to? Anywhere but here. Reuben? Connor? Did you know Leo's nose is bleeding? No. I hadn't noticed that. <coughs> since when was he coughing? He's just been doing it ever since we got down here. We figured it was the dust. If it's the dust, then we'd all be coughing. That's exactly what I said. I thought freaks didn't get sick. They don't. What's happening, Amari? I... I don't know. Here, just drink some water. I tried that too. Listen, we gotta leave while we still can. We'll deal with Leo once we get somewhere safer. I'll get the guns. You'll be alright, Leo. Just hold on a little longer. Okay. I'll try. Hey, what's that light behind us? I think it's... people. We need to start moving faster. We don't want them catching up with us. That would be bad if they did. They're moving pretty fast, aren't they? I don't think that's people. Then what is... Oh, for God's sakes. RUN! It's no use running. The next station is miles away. Quickly! In here!
that was way too close. You think? I thought trains weren't running anymore. That's what I thought. Why is so much weird stuff happening today? Tell me about it. Enough dawdling around. We gotta get out of Deltora. The longer we wait here, the more of a chance there is of running into more trouble. Ah, uh, since when was the sun so bright? Oh, stop complaining! Leo, are you feeling any better? Yeah, I'm not coughing anymore. See? Told you it was the dust. Leo, if you feel sick at all, let me know, okay? I will. Looks like we're not going back to Del Tora ever again. It's the worst attack yet. It sure is. So, what's the game plan now? We still need to get Samuel and Ellie back. How many weapons we got? Uh, a couple shotguns, a couple machine guns, with no ammo, and one grenade. And I have my bow as well, as well as another shotgun. That's not enough for an attack on Nexus. Any of us immune by any chance? Who's only alien, Samuel? All right, what about freaks, beside Leo? Why would we need another freak? I know that Nexus do tests on some freaks as well, especially elves. Well, do I look like a freak to you? Of course I'm a human. Amari? Amari and myself are human. Pure human. All right. I think we should find some shelter before the sun comes down. Great idea. I actually have a safe house nearby. We should be able to make it there before nightfall. Well, what are we waiting for? Jackson? Yeah? Thank you for not telling them. No problem. I'm pretty sure I left some weapons at the safe house, but I'm not sure if it'll be enough. Let's hope so if we want to kick some Nexus ass. Shh. Huh? You hear that? Guys? N Nexus helicopter! Quickly! Run! Why aren't they shooting at us? I... I have no idea! Amari, what are you doing? Wait! I don't think they want to hurt us. I mean... They aren't shooting. They're landing. Just step back a bit and aim your guns. Just in case. Wait, Samuel? Samuel, where you been? Where'd you get a Nexus helicopter from? Dude, what the hell? Samuel! You! Connor! You handed us over to Nexus! I'll kill you! Samuel, calm down! Why are you defending him? Connor, is this true? What? No! Why would I do that to you guys? You're... my first friends out here. You liar! How do you know it was him in the first place? What evidence do you have? I heard his voice. I know it was him. I saw a quick glimpse of him before blacking out. But how can you be sure it was him? You could have been hallucinating. Were you hit before you saw him? It was him! I know it! Samuel. Were you hit before you saw him? Y yes Samuel, I honestly don't know why you think it was me. I saw the Nexus guards take you, but they knocked me out. Sorry, Connor, but then who was it? 
I don't know, but we can't stay here much longer. We risk getting caught. And who are you supposed to be? Professor Evans, but call me Alicia. I helped your friend here get out of Nexus, but we're not done yet. We still need to get Ellie, but Sam requested to pick you all up first. Is Ellie okay? For now, but who knows for how much longer. We need to leave the region now. You mean, we're going across the ocean? Yes. Now please, all of you, follow me. We don't have much time left. You sure we can trust her? Positive. Guess we're going into the unknown. <sighs> what the? What happened here? Where is everyone? Hello? Uh, oh! Uh, okay, that's disgusting. So, uh, Jackson, what happened to your suit exactly? It got, uh, a little wrecked. I can finally see your face again. Haven't seen it in months. You should, you know, get rid of that beard you're getting, hey? But maybe I like it. Oh, uh, sure. Keep it. I, I didn't mean it like that. <laughs> I'm just messing with you. Calm down. I'm getting rid of it as soon as I get the chance to. Oh, good. I really want to be friends with a gorilla. <laughs> hey! What are you laughing about? Sorry, but... <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on. It's not that funny. <laughs> you have to be kidding me. You okay? We have a problem. What kind of problem? We're low on fuel. We won't have enough to make it to the base. Is there anywhere else we can land? Sam, we don't have enough fuel to land. What? In other words, we're going to have a rough landing. Okay, everyone. We have a few issues that have come up. We have to crash land the helicopter. Excuse me? Uh, what's your name? Ruben. Ruben, I need you to make sure Wells, the guy laying down in the back there, is tied up tight. Everyone, fasten your seatbelts. It'll be a bumpy ride down. And what's your name? Amari, is it? I need you to wake up the little one. Sure. Leo, wake up. Quickly, get your seatbelt on. Everyone okay? Other than my glasses breaking, I think I'm good. Leo, you okay? That was fun! Yeah, it was a joyride. Levels of security in this region are higher than in others. We have to keep moving if we don't want to get caught. How far away is this base? A couple miles north of here. And why is the security higher? Well, I can't say. Just know that we have to make this mission quick. But we don't even have weapons. Check the back. W wow. That's what you call a lot of guns and ammunition. Carry what you can and let's get going. Samuel, help Jackson and Connor carry Wells. Ah, 
Water. Since when was there birds? Oh, shoot! That's not good. I need to get back to the others. Why is this base so uh, unprotected? They were attacked. And how do you know that? I'm pretty sure the guard should be on two feet and breathing. Something's wrong. Nexus security is usually very high. How would this be possible? They're not shot. Only sign of death is black blood. Isn't that... They weren't attacked. Somehow the virus got inside the facility. Doesn't Nexus have a quarantine system? Yes, but this is one of the smaller facilities. It isn't as strict. They must have had a patient here that caught the virus. I thought you said Ellie was here. And she should be. Let's all split up and look around. We'll leave Wells somewhere safe inside. This happened recently. Amari... Where are you? Great. Just great! Leo, have you seen Ellie anywhere? No, I haven't. When can we go back home? I'm sorry, Leo, but it's just not safe for us in Tazara anymore. But I promise, we'll find a new home. With the others? Yeah, with the others. But they aren't freaks like us. It doesn't matter. They're our friends. Our new family. Exactly. And we always will be, Leo. And how long have you been standing there for? Not long, don't worry. We've searched the whole lab. There's no sign of Ellie anywhere. What do we do now? I don't know. Jackson? Samuel hasn't got anything planned as of yet, but Alicia says we should leave before anyone from Nexus decides to show up. Sam really has no idea what we're doing. Does he? No, he really doesn't. We really need Ellie back. There's something about her that shows leadership. She may not be the strongest out of all of us. She's still learning, but she knows how to make the right decisions. We'll get her back. First, we just need to figure out where she is. Yeah. You're worried about her, huh? Of course I am. She's like a sister to me. Right. Well, I can promise that we'll get her back. Come on, the others are waiting for us. So, what's the plan, Sammy? Don't call me that. Sorry. Sammy. Ugh, whatever. Ruben, you know of any bunkers or safe houses nearby? Jackson, I don't even know this region. It's all new to me. That's why I'm documenting this all. I'm trying to make a map. This region sure is interesting. Alicia, do you know any places? Yeah, but we'll have to make a run for it. We can't be out here when it's night. Is it like a bunker or something? No, there's an underground mall nearby. Race of air! Hey! 
Wait up! <laughs> Such kids. Quickly, get back inside! Acid rain! Ah! God! It, the rain! It's- Ah! Wait a sec. It's not burning. The rain... It's... Impossible. Why isn't the rain burning your skins? Remarkable. It's raining! Woo! Party! Woo! <laughs> so many unanswered questions. Lighten up, Doc. Try to have some fun for at least a minute. Come on, Ruby, let's dance! Woo! Singing in the rain! Never thought I'd ever be able to stand in rain and not scream from pain. <laughs> Me either. <coughs> Leo? Yeah, I... <coughs> <coughs> it's the rain. Everyone inside now. Leo! Amari! It's too late! We have to get you inside now! Quickly, someone get some water. Why are you freaking out so much, Jackson? It seems the rain only affects freaks. Exactly, you nitwit! None of us but Leo are freak. Amari's a freak! Now get the damn water! Here. Why didn't you tell us, huh? Hey, no need to get mad at her. She did nothing wrong. This whole time, we thought we were carrying one freak with us. But there was two? So what? It was easier to hide a little kid, but her? Listen, she just lost a little brother. I think she needs some space. We can't trust freaks. She hasn't heard us yet. Why would she now? She can help us. Hands up. That was unexpected. I knew you weren't a guard. Wow, and congratulations for figuring it out. Would you like a medal? No thanks. Bells. There's no need for that. Why are you helping them? You're betraying Nexus. Wait until Carter finds. He was really starting to get on my nerves. Alicia, did he just say Carter? Yeah, he's just the co-leader of some of the Nexus organizations. Why do you ask? Oh, no reason. So, can we kill him now? No, we might need him. But he's just dead weight to carry around. You want to kill an innocent life? I don't think you realize, but you're the one killing hundreds of immune and freaks, and now humans too. I know you're upset. I am too. That's why I'm helping you. If you're going to help us, then... You follow our rules. Number one, we do not carry around dead weight. I think it's best we all rest for the night here, wait till the rain dies down before we search for Ellie again. Sounds good to me. I'm hitting the sack. Fascinating. What are you doing with Leo's body? I wanted to do a quick test. You don't have the right to be doing tests on my brother! I know that, but I needed to know something, and I was right. Right about what? It wasn't the rain that killed Leo, otherwise you would be dead too. He's got the virus inside his bloodstream. How is that possible? I believe that someone has found a way to make Freak sick. I'm guessing he was injected with the virus, or maybe even given pills. Has he been injected with anything recently? Not that I know of. I do remember something about him complaining about getting an injection, but that's all. Has he been coughing, sneezing, bleeding, had a fever, or throwing up recently? Yeah, he was coughing down in the subway, but we assumed it was the dust. Well, this changes everything. Freaks aren't as adapted to the virus as we thought. You mean to say that freaks can get the virus? Yes, not from the air, but from the certain chemical that was in the syringe Leo was injected with. Whatever this chemical is, it's going to be a big problem. You need to start being more cautious, Amari, if Nexus finds out about this. 
What would happen if Nexus did find out about this chemical? All I can say is there would be no such thing as a freak anymore. Rain's clear. Everyone ready to head out? Yep, all set. Where will we be looking for Ellie? I'm thinking we head on south. Ellie wouldn't have gone too far. Let's hope not, because I'm not up for a long walk. My legs are killing me. We need to make sure we don't go out in the open. I suggest heading towards the closest town. Nexus aircraft fly by all the time in this region. We can't risk getting caught. Very true. I certainly am not up for getting shot today. Where's Jackson and Amari? They should be coming shortly. Let's get a bit of a head start. They'll catch up. You okay? Yeah, I'm good. You don't look okay. I'm sorry about you. Don't be sorry. It's probably for the better anyway. This way, he doesn't have to be in the middle of all this mess. Amari, it's okay to be upset about losing someone. You shouldn't hold in your feelings all the time. You're not alone anymore. You have all of us. I'll, uh, meet you outside. <laughs> He's dead! <laughs> My little brother! He's dead! They're <laughs> going to kill us all! <laughs> we won't be able to stop them! Wait, what are you talking about? Leo didn't die from the rain. He got the virus from an injection. Alicia said there's a chemical that gives freaks the virus. What, what happens if the Nexus gets the chemical? What happens if... Amari, what happens to your brother, it won't happen to you. I'll make sure of it. I'll make sure that nothing happens to you. We should catch up with the others. Yeah. Hey, about time you two caught up. What's taking you so long? Just making sure there wasn't anything valuable in the lab. So, Amari. What kind of freak are ya? Are you a werewolf, or a vampire, or maybe even a fairy? Do you have some sort of supernatural power? I'm an elf, Connor. Oh, well, uh, that's still cool. Just leave her alone for a bit. Right. Sorry. Is that... trees? I thought Tessera was the only green life left. Tessara is one of the last green life areas left. But it's not safe here, in there, is Nexus territory. Hey, there's someone in the distance. It, Ellie. You sure it's her? Ellie! Is that Ellie? Uh, I'm assuming so. Samuel? Are you okay? What did they do to you? Just some tests, but... Uh, Amari? It's so great to see you again. It's great to see you too. Where have you been? I don't really know. I was in a lab. The next minute, I wake up in a destroyed lab. I'm so glad to see you, Ellie. I... I thought I'd lose you too. Don't worry, I'm right here, Amari. But, um, where's Leo? He's... he's not here anymore. What do you mean? He got sick. But freaks don't get sick. 
Sorry to ruin this reunion, but there's a Nexus aircraft heading this way. We have to take cover. Recap stories for later. And who are you? I'm Alicia. Now, enough talk. Let's get moving, kids. Trees, now. You said that was Nexus territory. It's better than staying out here. Now move it. That's a lot of planes. There's never usually that many. They've increased their defenses. Why would they need to do that? They're looking for Ellie. Are you sure there's boats here? I'm positive. How much further we got? We're nearly at the shore. How are you even sure there's fuel for the boats? I'm not sure. Let's just hope there is for our sakes. And where will we go once we get back to the other region? I've got a bunker we can go to till we've made a game plan. How'd you get all these bunkers? I'm quite a wealthy woman, Jackson, thanks to Mr. Carter. You two are close? Closer than I'd like. Now all of you, stop asking me so many questions. Alright, good news. There's fuel in the butts. Hopefully it'll be enough. Good to hear. Everyone on board now. We must get out of here before more aircraft come by. Are these, you know, safe? Positive. I don't really trust this. I'm sorry about Leo. It's alright. You sure we can trust that Alicia? I... I don't know. Samuel seems to trust her. He seems to be in charge. But now that you're back, hopefully you can take charge. Me? Yeah, you're a leader, Ellie. I can see it in you. You always make the right decisions for our survival, and that's what we need. I don't know if being in charge is my thing. Of course it's your thing. We need you. All of us. You're like a natural-born leader. I knew it as soon as I met you. What about you? Ellie, if I was born to be a leader, I would have stayed in Tazara. But being in charge... Nah, I prefer the dangerous fighting stuff. It's more exciting. Bit like Jackson. I suppose. But... But what? Don't tell the others this, but... I don't like fighting the way everyone else does. What do you mean? When people say that freaks are monsters, it's not exactly a lie. When I fight, it's like my mindset changes. I start getting th this craving to see blood. Like a vampire? You drink blood. Ew, no! I wouldn't drink it. Just the sight. Against Nexus, that's the kind of fighting we need. I guess. Nexus will pay for what they've done. To all of us. Let's be realistic for a second. Our small group against a whole organization that's worldwide. That probably has some secret army. Yeah, we'll totally be able to take them out. We'll find a way. We just have to stay positive. You know it's impossible to defeat them. Hey, Alicia, could I speak with you for a moment? Sure. I have a couple of questions about Mr. Carter. Yes? Did he ever have a wife? He did, but she caught the virus and obviously died since we didn't have a cure. We still don't. He also used to have a son too, but he got sick and died as well. Do you happen to know the son's name at all? Hmm, I think... I think it was Jackson. 
Huh, what a coincidence. You both have the same name. What's your last name? Oh, uh, Williams. Huh, interesting. So you said you and Mr. Carter are close? Yes, we are. I rather wouldn't be, but I have to keep my job now, don't I? Yeah. You know, he sorta of looks a little like you. Oh, really? Yeah, you've both got the same eyes, same hair color, except he started going gray, of course. He's getting older, but he's still the same arrogant, insolent man I work with. Land ahoy! Quiet down, will ya? I guess we're here. And before nightfall, too. Perfect timing. We have a bit of a walk till we reach the bunker. This time we'll be safer walking around since there's not as many aircrafts that fly here, as you'd know. Great news! Well, this is just great. What's wrong? Got sunburnt. Usually I don't go outside much. You know what Del Toro was like. We'll put some cream on that. You could get sick otherwise. Hang on. Excuse me? There's a lot of ways you can catch the virus. Next, the scientists have come up with some interesting information. Oh, jeez. Well, let's get that cream. Quick! I have a quick question. Why didn't the rain hurt us earlier? We figured that most of the time the rain will come down like acid rain. While there's some rare times, like then, when it's completely safe. How does that work? I wish I could answer that. Maybe soon. Nexus have been doing a lot of research over the past 25 years. Sometimes we're successful, other times we're not. Why are you helping us? I just wanted to help you get Samuel and Ellie out. I'll leave soon. I can't be away too long or Carter will start asking questions. That didn't answer my question. Why are you helping us? Because it's the right thing to do. How can we trust you? I mean, I'm not forcing you to trust me. You just decided to. I'm not going to hurt any of you. When you want me to leave, I'll leave. Where is that cream? Here. Thank you. And put the cream everywhere, even in areas where you weren't burnt. Wait, so... Yes, the bathroom is at the end of the hall on your right. R right. So, how are we going to take down Nexus? I'm thinking we attack from the inside. Ruben's good with computers, right? Yeah, he can hack, do coding. Perfect. Now we just... Need a map of the facility? I got that covered. Here, Amari and I got it when you and Ellie went missing. This is great. I'll start working with Ellie and Alicia on the plan. You and the others get some rest. You'll need it. Just listen. We need more fighters, so we can make an alliance with the freaks. You're insane. But it could work. They have hundreds that can fight. Seems risky. Ruben, can you go get Amari? She can help. Alright. The freaks will kill us instantly, and you know that. I mean, what if we did a trade? A trade? Yeah. Amari is the princess, right? We could trade her in to make peace. No way we're doing that. Why not? Ellie, you know that giving her is the only way. I know, but... She left for a reason. Even I don't know why. I think we should find another way. Fine. What else could we offer? Information. Information about what? About the chemical that killed Leo. If we tell them, then they will have time to prepare. Just in case Nexus does get a hold of it. It could work, but they would want a cure. There's no cure for the virus, but there is something we have developed at Nexus. It didn't work, but that was on a human. We've never tested it on the freaks since they shouldn't be able to get sick anyway. So we tell them about the chemical, then we tell them about the cure. Would that be enough? Let's hope so, but we should still use Amari as backup. I told you, Sam, we're not giving Amari to them. Guys? 
Ruben, what's wrong? Kamari's not in her room. Or anywhere. Huh? And what's even more interesting is that Connor isn't here either. Great. Connor and Amari decided to run off. Just what we needed. No. They didn't run away. Connor left a note. Let me see. Myself and Amari have left. Don't come looking. You'll never find us anywhere. Just know that you should never trust a human like me. Good luck on your plan to destroy Nexus. Connor. Dayona gang. Well, at least we don't have to deal with them anymore. Why would Amari want to leave? I don't think she did. It says Dayona gang, meaning Connor works for them. I knew that boy was a troublemaker. I know where the main Dayona gang base is. If we head there now... We're not going after Amari, Jackson. What? It's too risky. Our priority is to make an alliance with the freaks. If we don't go after Amari now, they'll kill her! Jackson, we simply do not have enough time to go after her. What? So you're saying she's dead, way? Everyone shut up! Samuel, leaving her there is the wrong thing to do. She's our friend. However, Jackson, it's too risky. Amari would want us to leave her and focus on the plan. As close as I am to Amari, we need to make the right decisions for our survival. This is what she would want. Fine. You guys go make your little alliance with the freaks and die trying. I'm going after Amari and making sure Connor gets a good beating. Well, I suppose we should add a Tessera then. Yes. Let's get moving. Ronnie, I brought you what you requested. Ah, excellent. She's not only a freak, but she's also royalty. Where's the other one? He died. You were supposed to bring him to me. Well, I'm sorry, but I guess one of your hunter groups injected him with the virus. So it worked. It was very successful. You knew about this, Connor? You knew he was going to die? Of course I knew. I also knew that you and Ellie were the ones who attacked the camp. That's when I realized you were a freak. You've been following us the whole time? How did you think I found you and Jackson? Here's your pay. This is only half of what you promised me. You were supposed to bring the boy too, but I guess you were too late. But I also gave you two immunes. Who escaped. You taken Ellie and Samuel too? You're all dumber than you look. Here's your next assignment, and don't disappoint me this time. Of course, Ronnie. I'll get it done as soon as possible. And you must be Amari then. I'm sorry about your brother's death. Leo, right? Don't you dare say his name. You don't have that right. I'm Ronnie, leader of Diana Gang. If you want me to be honest, I don't really care who you are. Maybe you will, once I do this. <laughs> what are you... We recently discovered this chemical that stops freaks from being immune to the virus. Now just imagine the big money we'll make when we hand this over to Nexus. I know what will happen then. All freaks will die. Oliver, I'm heading out. Take Amari's blood every hour and record the changes. Hey, where do you think you're going? I've got some business to take care of. Nice meeting you, but sadly, I'll never see you again, since, you know. You won't get away with this. But I can try. And when Nexus is on our side, we'll be unstoppable. Are you guys sure we should be letting Jackson go by himself? It was his choice, Ruben. He wanted to leave. But I mean, he's... He left. That's it. If you want to go with him so badly, then just go. I think I'd rather stay with you. That's what I thought. 
Why do I feel like this is a bad idea? It probably is. But we need more people to fight. But we also need Amari and Jackson. I... I know. I always seem to make the wrong choices. Hey, it's okay. We all make bad decisions. I'm sure they'll come back soon. Amari is able to go through hell and back. It's not just that, Ellie. I'm not sure having Alicia taking charge is the best idea. We can't exactly ask her to leave. She helped you out of Nexus. You'd be dead if it wasn't for her. Yeah, but there's something off about this. Let's get this alliance done first. Then we'll worry about Alicia. Sounds like a plan. Amari! Jackson? What are you doing here? You're supposed to be with the others. You saved me. Now it's my turn to save you. Connor, he... I know. He took you, didn't he? Yeah, he works for Diona. And not just that, but he's the one that handed Samuel and Ellie over to Nexus. Should have known not to trust him. Don't blame this on yourself. You didn't know. None of us did. I... I guess. Are you okay? I'm fine. Not even a scratch. That's very good news. Did you seriously take out all the guards? They're not that hard to fight. <laughs> what was that? I think it came from over here. To the remains of humanity. For the past 25 years, scientists at Nexus have been working to find a cure. However, we've been unsuccessful. After multiple trials, we've created a nuclear bomb that will be planted on Deltora. This bomb will wipe out most of this region. To any humans in this region, we highly recommend you evacuate the area. You have 48 hours. They can't be serious. Can they? Why is my dad turned into a monster? He did this? My dad's the co-leader of Nexus, says Alicia. What about your mom? Apparently she's... dead. I'm sorry for bringing that up. I didn't know much anyway. Now, we need to find the others before 48 hours is up. Find them? Don't you know where they are? They... left for Tassara. Samuel and myself had a bit of an argument. It was about coming to save you. Everyone else decided to go to Tassara over... you. They made the right choice, leaving me behind. Why didn't you go with them? I wasn't just going to leave you here. I heard you for when you sent me back into Tassara. And for stitching on my wound, and fixing my suit when we first met, and giving me- Okay, okay. <laughs> I get it. Plus, I- We all need you back. Okay, well, we have less than 48 hours to get to Zara, find the others, and then evacuate? We won't have enough time for that. We'll have to figure something else out instead. But if Nexus now has their hands on nukes, who knows what they'll do next. I hope not much more. Alicia, where are you? We need you back. I'm just collecting some work supplies from one of the smaller Nexus bases. What's wrong? The nuke is ready. You have 48 hours to get back. You didn't even think about all the innocent humans you'd kill? You knew we would have to do this sooner or later. This will wipe out some of the virus. Mateo, I told you this hundreds of times. It won't work. You can't just get rid of a virus from a nuke. Either way, it's happening. Get back to Nexus Base 79. See you soon. Alicia, you coming? Yeah, I'm coming. Here's the plan. Myself and Sam will go to the gates and talk with whoever. 
You two need to stay here, just in case something goes wrong. Sounds good to me. We should make this happen quick. You okay? You look very... worried. I'm okay. If you're nervous about this not working out, it will. Trust me. You ready, Sam? I'm always ready. Hello? Loud enough? I'm just trying to get their attention. You got their attention, all right. What are you doing here, humans? We just want to talk to your leader. Why should we let you do that? We have some information that may be valuable to your people. You think we can trust them? I don't know. They seem suspicious. We should get an island. No need. Open the gates. Are you sure? They could... Just open the gates. Right away! So, what are you disgusting humans doing at Tessera? We're here to negotiate, possibly make an alliance. Ha! <laughs> now why would we make an alliance with you? You must be joking, right? We want to destroy Nexus once and for all, but we need people to fight. I'm quite happy to keep my army away from your pathetic revenge party. Just listen. There's a chemical humans have discovered that will give freaks the virus. What? That's impossible. You really think I'm that dumb to believe that rubbish? Freaks adapted to the virus. We live with it. Yeah, well, this chemical will. We don't know how it works, but it kills whatever is in your body that protects you from the virus. We've seen a freak die from it. It's a slow, very slow process. But if Nexus gets a hold of it... Stop trying to trick me into whatever alliance you have. I don't think you realize. If you could help us, then we could save everyone. And no freaks will die. I'm not putting my men in danger. Please, we beg you. We also have a cure for the chemical. But you can only have it if we team up. Humans and freaks will never, ever be at peace. Then why is Amari at peace with us? You know Amari. She's my best friend. Amari is a traitor. I can see why she decided to leave, though. Me too. I don't appreciate your attitude. So what? Now, is it a deal or not? I told you, freaks and humans will never be at peace. Guards! You can't just kidnap us. We have a backup. A whole army. Lots of men in the forest surrounding you. You're outnumbered. I hope you're not talking about them, are you? Because I have to say, that is a massive army you've got. Why do I have to speak? Why can't I be the one to suddenly jump out and attack? Because you're a freak. You can talk to them. No, I can't. Nylon will kill me, Jackson. I'll make sure that doesn't happen. I'll be right beside you. Hidden, of course. And you're positive the freaks have them? I told you when I climbed the tree and looked over the fence. They were tied up near a fire. Were people gathering? Yeah, it looked like it. It's a... sacrifice. Sacrifice? There's a few things you don't know about us freaks. We love blood. They're going to kill them. Kill them? And they're going to kill them in the most brutal way possible. How brutal are we talking? I think it's best if you don't know. 
How do we stop it? There's only one way. We attack the freaks. You sure? That's a good idea. If we don't, then they'll die. Negotiating with Nylon won't be enough. How do we get in without getting caught? This way. There's this hole in the wall that Nyla and I used to use to leave the village when we were younger. And you were allowed to do that? No, but we left anyway. What if it's all closed off? Let's hope it's not. Here, use this. A lighter? You want to set a fire? Yeah, for a distraction. That's a great idea. What made you think of that? Learning from a specific someone. With a bow and arrow as a weapon. And long brunette hair. I think it was a she. Very funny. Wait. You knew it was me and Ellie who attacked the camp? People were shot dead by arrows, which happened to be yours. I assumed you and Ellie attacked them. We did. You two did good, attacking them all by yourselves. Now you just have to do it again. Once they're distracted, hopefully everyone will run towards the fire. Then we get the others out of here. Exactly. FIRE! It's working! Yeah. You okay? I'm fine. No more freaks. Time to go. Amari? Jackson? Miss us? Wow. I wasn't expecting you guys to come here. I told you I knew where Amari was. I'm sorry we didn't come for you, Amari. I- Whoa, whoa, whoa. Ellie, don't apologize. I understand why you didn't. You made the right choice. Okay, can we please get out of here? Yes, this way. We need to leave. Samuel, Ellie, Alicia, here, take these guns. Oh, perfect. You alright, Ruben? Could be better. I need you to run to that wall over there. There's a hole. Climb through and wait for us. I'll go with Ruben. Good idea. Cover your mouths. The smoke is getting thicker. Guys, I think we've killed a lot of freaks. Or at least injured them. We should just leave them. I agree. Some of these people are innocent. Alright, let's get out of Tessera. Blood is survival, Mari. Amari, come on! You're weak if you cannot kill. Blood is power, gives you strength. Blood is survival. Amari! Amari, just stop. Calm down. But people you can trust and who are there for you is stronger than anything else. Just let it go. It's okay. Even more than blood, Amari. Keep them close to you. You was waiting for us. Come on! Now that we have everyone, let's head to the bunker I grew up in. Can't we have a quick rest? We don't have time for a rest, Ruben. There's something that Mario and myself need to explain to you all. Something that will potentially kill us all. <sighs> we just go from one problem to the next, don't we? How bad is whatever you want to talk about? From a scale of 1 to 10, 1 being a very minor issue, to 10 being something that will more than likely kill us. 11. So... It will kill us. 
If we don't get moving now, then yes, it'll kill us. Alright, lead the way, Jackson. So, you mean to say that Nexus plans to nuke the region? Yeah, and we don't have long. About maybe a day and a half, if that. So. That's not enough time to get out of the region. Are there any bunkers deep enough underground we know of? No. And remember, we need enough supplies to last us all at least ten days while we're in the bunker. Alicia, doesn't some of the Nexus bases have bunkers? Yes, most do, but it won't have enough supplies for all of us. We could try to get as far away as possible, and seek shelter underground. The further away we are, the better. If we, I don't know, run, then we might make it out of this region just in time. It's too risky. Amari, does Tassara have any bunkers? No. We never prepared for nukes to come down and hit us. What about the subway in Deltora? Radiation from the nuke will slip inside easily. Are there any bunkers in Del Toro? Of course there is, but how do you expect to find an accessible one when the city got destroyed? For all we know, Diona Gang could still be there. We're all just thinking about hiding underground. What if there was another way? Are you suggesting we find a helicopter? That could work. We'd be able to get out of the region in time. Too risky. Why does everything have to be too risky? I wasn't talking about using a helicopter. Then what? What if we went to space? Nope. I'm out. Why would we do that? I didn't tell you all this, but I have a sister. A sister? Yes, and her alongside the whole group of immunes are up in the space station orbiting Earth. We could go up to their station and we could all work together and make a proper plan to destroy Nexus. Exactly. And you're sure they would agree? I can talk with my sister. Then she could persuade the others. It's a good plan and all, but how do you expect us to get up into space in the first place? I'm sure Alicia could help us out with that. I'm sorry, but Nexus doesn't have any spaceships in this region. Not that I know of, anyway. I might know a place. It's a small underground facility. It was for space research, I believe. I know there's a ship down there but we'll have to fix it up first. Would you be able to fix it in time? I think so. With Alicia's help, they'll get the job done faster. How far away is it? Close, but actually, maybe an hour walk or so. Perfect! Sounds like we're going to space. Yep. Amari, you okay? Yeah. Uh, hey, your nose is bleeding. Isn't that what happened to Leo, too? Yeah, it was. If we're going to get to that ship, we should leave within the hour. Okay, everyone, start packing your belongings. Ruben, do we have everything you'll need to fix the ship with? Yep. Plus, the facility probably will have tools anyway. <coughs> <coughs> was that Amari? <coughs> Alicia, it's... She's been infected. Amari, did you get injected? I'm fine. Really. Just, you know, small cold, but, but I can... Listen to me, Amari. Did you get injected? Yeah. Uh, but I'll be fine. Let me do some blood tests. I won't be long. Okay. You feeling okay? Yeah. 
Oh, good. You need to learn to tell us these things. I know. I just didn't want to worry you all. We have enough to deal with. I, uh, I'm just going to go outside and get some fresh air. Alicia, how bad? It's bad. I'm sorry to say this, but she's not going to make it. No, there has to be a way to stop it. Jackson, it's impossible. But didn't you say something about a cure Nexus has been developing? Yes, it, it could work on a freak, but I can't guarantee it, and I don't even have it with me. The closest place to find it is another abandoned Nexus base. How far away is it? We would only have enough time to get there, but not enough to get back. But you also said there's bunkers in every Nexus base. There's not enough supplies in the bunkers to last all of us. Who said we were all going? What do you mean? Why wouldn't we all go? I'll take a moment to the base myself, while the rest of you get to the immunes in space. You want to go by yourself? That's suicide for both you and Amari. Yeah, well, it's suicide for Amari if I don't take her. At least this way, she might have a chance. We don't even know that medicine will work, Jackson. We can try, can't we? I mean, it could save her. You sure you want to go alone, though? I could come with you. You can't go, Ruben. We need you to help fix the ship. I'll go. Most definitely not. Ellie, you can't be put into any danger. You're immune. Well, more than immune. Uh, excuse me? Just, you can't go. You guys get going. Time's ticking. Alright, but Jackson, the virus is getting into Amari's bloodstream and throughout her body at a much faster rate than it did with Leo. How long does she have? It's hard to say. Maybe 24 hours, maybe 30, maybe more or less. But just know that the virus is affecting her much differently than it did with Leo. Why is it affecting her differently? It could be many things. Her age, gender, she could be weaker, maybe she was injected more or a stronger dose. It comes down to many different factors. All I know is that she'll more than likely start losing the ability to use parts of her body. Be aware of that, Jackson. Not taken. Time's precious. Let's get going. Amari, you ready? Yeah, all set. Alright, let's go. We're not waiting for the others? I thought we'll go into the ship. They are. We're not. How come? The nuke is going to hit soon, and- You're sick. If we go with them, you'll- But this way you'll have a chance. I'm already infected with the virus. It'll kill me anyway. There's a medicine. It might stop it. It might save you. Really? Yes. Then, I I'll go and get it. You go with them. I can't let you go there alone. Something could go wrong. But the nuke... I'm taking you to the base, whether you like it or not. Amari! You'll be okay. I know you will. I'll miss you. <laughs> hey, don't start crying. We'll see each other again soon. And that's a promise. Don't make promises you can't keep, Ellie. Protect them. Okay? I will. They need a leader. Like you. Damn it. Now you're making me cry. Enough with the waterworks, girls. Time to go. Jackson, protect her, okay? Will do. Ruben, what's taking so long? The door is just... a little stuck. Just break it. That's what I've been trying. Oh, for God's sakes, let me do it. No, I got it. Just let me already. Fine, but I'm telling you, you won't be strong enough. You're just a... G girl. You were saying? Uh, carry on. Alicia, door's opened. I'll meet you guys down there. Suit yourself. Miss Evans, if you don't get back here to Nexus, you know what will happen to him. <laughs> I know. I hope to see you soon. For your sake.
Wow, this place is awesome. This is incredible. I guess we found a spaceship. Let's hope it won't blow up on the way there. Look around for some tools Reuben and I can use. Uh, I think I just found the jackpot. It was like this crate was sitting here waiting for us. Enough doodling around. Let's repair this ship. We have just over an hour to the new kids. We should make it to the base before then. Hopefully. Then all we have to do is find the medicine, then the bunker. It'll be. J Jackson! What? Amari! Let me help you up. J Jackson, I, I can't. You can't? You can't what? I, I can't get up. I, I, I can't feel my legs. Hey, that's okay. Just stay calm, okay? Just breathe. I, I, I can't move. I can't. It's okay. Y you gotta go to the base. Just leave me. I I'm gonna slow you down. Don't be stupid. I'm not leaving you here. I... I can carry you. What? No. See? It's not that hard. What are you up to? I'm just looking around. Found anything interesting? No, I was hoping I would, though. I've never asked you. Where are you from? Honestly, I have no idea. Huh? About a month ago, I woke up in this lab place. With no memory on who I am, who I knew, I know nothing about myself, only my name. No way. Why are you looking at me like that? Agrippa. What? are you talking about? There's a small group of immunes who first survived the death wave. Nexus was looking for them since they were the strongest immune you could find. Most were killed, but some were protected. What does that have to do with anything? I'm saying that you're one of those people, Ellie. You were protected. That's why when Nexus got a hold of you, they wanted to do more tests. But I'm just like other immunes. No, you're not. You're really not. So, what does this mean? It's hard to explain. And I can't be sure yet, but... It means you're both immune... and a freak. Sit here. I'm going to open the door. Okay. Why won the damn thing open? Jackson! Don't worry, I got the door open. Jackson! I'm right in front of you. E everything's spinning. It's going dark. How many fingers am I holding up? I, I can't see you. I can't see anything. Where are you? I'm here. Time to go find that medicine. Okay. How's the ship? It's all set. Alicia just had to double check a few things inside. Great, so I'm guessing we'll leave shortly then? I mean, if we don't leave within the next 20 minutes or so, then we'll die. So yes, we'll be leaving shortly. How much can we take on board? I'd recommend that we don't carry any luggage. The less we weigh, the better. Why is the ship starting up? Maybe Alicia pressed the wrong button? No, she's leaving. Alicia, what are you doing? Listen, I'm sorry I have to do this. Why are you leaving us here? 
Because Nexus needs me back. If I don't go now, something bad will happen. What about us? You're just going to leave us to die? I'm sorry. Good luck. We're screwed. You wait here, okay? And don't leave this spot. Wait, where are you going? I'm just going to find the medicine. I'll come right back. Whatever you do, do not move from here. Okay, I'll stay here. Where the hell is it? <coughs> Preparing, I found it! Where are you? Jackson, I, I can't feel my hands. I can't feel anything. It's okay, I found it. Where are you? I'm here, right here. You need to take this right now. What if it doesn't work? It will. I know it will. Five minutes till impact. Did you find the bunker? No. You go and find it. You need to survive. I'm not leaving you alone here. Please, just just go and find it. I don't think I need to. I think it's right in front of us. We should be safe down here. The nuke will hit any minute. Do you know if the others made it into space? No, but I'm sure they did. Why haven't you killed me yet? Why would I kill you? I'm a freak. A monster. You saw me in Zara. I, I was craving blood and to make it worse for my own people. You're not a monster. You never were. You never will be. I've killed so many people. You have to kill to survive. I'm going to die. Aren't I? You don't even know if the meds will help. You're not going to die. I won't let it happen. Hey, are you holding my hand? Wh what No. I swore I felt your hand. Wait. You could feel my hand. Yeah. That means the pills are working. Really? You're going to be okay. I told you I wouldn't let you die. Thank you. Are you sure we'll be deep enough? Let's hope so, or the radiation will kill all of us. Keep running. What are you doing? It's a metal door! How else are we supposed to get inside? Like that. Get on the ground and cover your ears! Now! Nexus has successfully nuked the whole of Section 7, wiping the whole of Deltora along with Tessera and other ruins left from humanity 25 years ago. Scientists have been sent to the site now to do testings for the virus. We have officially killed thousands of freaks and humans who could have been a potential threat to Nexus and our work. However, we are nowhere near finished. It's time for Stage 2. My heart's a drum Let it breathe, let it breathe My heart's a drum And when the beat stops, I'll be the 
the death of me